Betting is officialized. It's happening. And the betting houses are earning hundreds of millions of dollars, maybe billions for all the tennis. So there's, there's huge value there. And then uh, lots of interest sides in the tennis ecosystem are also benefiting from there through that um, uh, data, data deal. But the players are getting a shorter end of the stick and are, are getting literally crumbles or nothing almost. So that's, that's what I think the focus should be because being in the player council of ATP for you know, almost a decade, whenever we would address this subject, what would normally surface in the discussion is the integrity. Right? It's like we gotta fight to make sure that our that our game, that the sport stays clean. We gotta make sure that the players are not cheating, they are not betting, they're not compromising the the tournament is etc. Cetera, etc. Cetera, et cetera, et cetera. Which of course I support and agree with, but there's a kind of a, 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 a psychological game, right? That you you focus on that and you don't really talk about the main issue here that us players need to be aware of.